Today I am Untavet. <laughs> I am traveling to Bremen. My suitcase over yeah, here. So I am so excited because actually it's the first time since I arrived in Germany that I am getting to travel literally like overnight outside the city of Duisburg and it's starting to rain. <laughs> My goodness, <laughs> it's starting to rain. But I'm headed to the train station now. Uh, to the local train station and then I'll go to the Hauptbahnhof and uh, take the train. I still have some time but it's a good thing that I decided to leave the house a little bit earlier because it's coming to rain. It's coming to rain. Otherwise, yeah, that's the deal. I'm gonna visit my Kenyan sister over there. Yeah, in uh, Bremen and uh, I'm taking you guys along of course and <laughs> I have to run. See you! <laughs> station Gleich. I'm gonna be going to Gleich 12 and I'm quite early because I'm supposed to leave at 4.48 but it's 4.11 <laughs> yeah <laughs> no African timing so my train is uh, yeah this one right here 4.48 Hamburg yeah that one is my train and uh, so i'm going to just sit there and wait because the weather is also not very promising there is not so much that i can do I'm just going to sit there and wait for the train and then we see how it's gonna go in bremen see ya I 
course I arrived at around 7 in the evening and then I had to wait for my friend or my sister to finish work then we went to a restaurant had some nice food and a lot of cocktails and shots <laughs> so we are coming back to the house at around midnight I was so tired so I hope you guys are doing fine so I today we are gonna go to explore the city of Bremen already so it is today and it's really beautiful and something about the cities here in Germany is that every city is different it has its own characteristics so it's always beautiful when you go to another place and you get to just to experience the richness in its culture and all that so again let me wake up <laughs> let me wake up and then I will see you later and then I will introduce my friend to you guys hi guys hello from Bremen and meet my sister hi. <laughs> yeah so yeah, of course I arrived yesterday and this wonderful lady here has treated me to <laughs> Kenyan hospitality, not German hospitality. <laughs> yeah, it has been so wonderful and today we are just out and about. We are going to, where are we going to? To Hamburg. Yep, we are Hamburg. going to Hamburg for the first time for me. And uh, yeah, we are taking you guys along. So enjoy the view. <laughs> So we are now in the Bremen Main, Bremen, yeah, Bremen Main Shopping Street and it's definitely like, oh no, I'm still wearing my mask. <laughs> uh, yeah, because I'm just <laughs> Yeah, but yeah, yeah, so we are at the Main Shopping Street and Bremen is definitely different from this book, <laughs> especially with the Strasseban. Those ones. Those ones are really interesting, but it's beautiful. Now, now I'm gonna know when I come up on a dome. Come here, follow. Everywhere, in the middle, that's the church. It's not a dome, the church is. Oh, yeah. yeah. The very old church. Yeah. So definitely, definitely very beautiful <laughs> city to visit. Different and interesting. So right here we were visiting the town musicians of Bremen, the four animals that you can see right there, the donkey, the dog, the cat and the chicken. There is a very famous story that you can actually look uh, uh, out for uh, even on YouTube but it's very rich in the culture of Bremen and of course the story was written by uh, some two brothers I believe from Bremen so that is what I and the other tourists that uh, you can see around there were doing so yeah and it was of course quite interesting and uh, apparently you can touch the statue and then wish for every anything and then it can come true so yeah You can put him. So on this uh, hall that looks like a money box right there, 
is also connected to the history of uh, the, the town musicians, of course. And our uh, people can normally drop in the coins or some coins, and then you will hear the sounds of one of the animals, either the cat or the donkey or the chicken or the dog. And it's just a way of the uh, city uh, to collect money for various charities or various projects. And it's definitely, definitely very interesting. And you cannot imagine how much money they collect in a day or even in a in, in, in a certain period of time when many people are visiting the city so something that you must do of course when you visit Bre Bre So guys, we are now at the Bremen. I almost said this book. <laughs> Bremen has done so beautiful. So I like like I like the story, like the gothic nature of it. So it's such a beautiful place. And now we are going to Hamburg. <laughs> it doesn't look so normal, not much. 